check out these tacos. Not only do they look beautiful, they taste delicious. But this week, we're not at a Mexican restaurant. We are at a Jamaican eatery at this food truck right here, B's Kitchen, Jamaican style. Now, this food truck has been at this location at the intersection of Major and 105 for almost two years here in Beaumont. But sadly, its stay here is short-lived. V's kitchen is small, but it's packed with big flavor. And V is Baron Banks, known to her customers as Chef V. It's gonna be good. Chef V came to the U.S. from her native Jamaica on a college track scholarship. I used to run, so I represent Jamaica a few times. But now she's a star running the food truck. Curry powder have to be cooked properly. One of her specialties, curry chicken. The curry chicken over white rice and the um, boneless chicken thighs. And now to the tacos we showed you earlier. They too are a big hit on V's menu, jerk chicken or jerk shrimp tacos. These tacos, it, it, it comes with cheese, cilantro, the pineapple, and um, the jerk sauce to the side, but, um, and the jerk chicken. So it's a jerk chicken breast, it's breaded chicken breast, and with my jerk sauce on it, on my jerk season. So it have a kick to it. The shrimp taco is, is um, just the same as the chicken uh, with the same um, season and everything. The only thing is different is the meat. So it's either the ch jerk chicken or the jerk shrimp. The food here is so popular, the customers start lining up before Chef V opens the serving window. Business is awesome. Um, I have some of the best customers in Southeast Texas, um, the Beaumont area. Uh, I mean, like every day I sold out. But soon Chef V will be putting the brakes on her food truck. Her husband's work is taking the family to Pensacola, Florida. So we're saying goodbye to Beaumont. Unfortunately, the news is leaving many of V's regulars heartbroken, including my friend and morning show co-anchor, Macy Meyer, who told me about this place. Guess what, Macy? What? V's not going to be here much longer. She's no. moving to Florida. Oh, yes. no. This is my last week. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, this is my last week. Oh, I know all your customers are going to be so sad. <laughs> yes, they are. <laughs> well, V made this special for yeah. us for the going away. So it to celebrate, not to celebrate, we're sad, but to celebrate your future, which is going to be great. Yeah. I think we're going to, what will we be taste testing right now? So you're taste testing the jerk shrimp taco and the jerk chicken tacos, and the jerk sauce is on the side. Ooh, my okay. goodness. Okay. Okay, Macy. So these two Look, right here is the shrimp, and then this one right here is the chicken. Oh, good. Okay. Two shrimps, so that means we can each have a shrimp. It looks delicious and smells so good. Okay, Macy. Thank um, you, V. Yeah, thank you. And our Sorry. usual toast. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers to Chef V. But there is a silver lining. One last chance for Southeast Texans to get their taste of Jamaica. I'm planning on doing um, jerk pork chops, brown stew chicken, curry chicken, rice and peas, mac and cheese, steamed cabbage with uh, carrots, and I'm going to be doing the ground beef. I'm, I'm sorry, baked beans with ground beef. And for all you fans of V's Kitchen Jamaican style, you will have one more opportunity to eat here. And that will be Saturday, August 24th from 1130 in the morning till 330 in the afternoon or until the food runs out, which could easily happen. Well, I'm ready to head out here with my curry chicken bowl, but before I eat it, I need to know where you want me to go next. All you have to do is like, comment, and subscribe down below.